Hi, welcome back to uh, part seven of making a uh, Ramson crook. Um, the last time you saw this, it was uh, under a plate, so it's been squeezed up. So what we've done, we've just tapered that nose a wee bit and flattened it. And what I want to do now is just heat that up again, um, pop it back in this um, uh, this little jig here, and just get that shape there because uh, it's standing away from the former a bit. So that's the next thing to do. Um, when we've done that we'll probably do a bit more cleaning up. Now we'll come back to you and show you what um, uh, what we've done and how we've progressed. So just warming the horn up here. Firstly, in the area that I want to just straighten off. Once we get around that block, I might warm the rest of it off and then just pull it in. And again, we're not going to have you sitting through all this boring heating, but uh, you might as well just see what we're doing. do we'll just see what it's like Yeah, I can see that we we want to warm all this up now. Uh, it's it's come away from the former quite a bit, so we're going to warm all that up and pull it all back in again. See if we can straighten this section here that we originally wanted to just straighten off, and um, see how we go. We're back soon. Okay, there we go. So that's been heated up, and uh, you can see from sort of uh, that angle. I put a sash clamp on to pull this area in a bit flatter than it was and we'll leave that now. Um, again it was leaving overnight and uh, then we'll come back to it. So once we've done that a bit more removal of material and um, we'll start getting it to a point where we can turn this nose and uh, that's an interesting operation. I hope you all tune in for that. Uh, because it'll be an eye-opener. Okay, thanks very much. We'll see you again.